welcome back to my channel it's Grazi thank you so much for clicking on this video and for everyone that's still here I know I have been missing in action for a minute but your girl has been getting married your girl has been moving into a new house like it's been so hectic like these last few months <laughs> but God is good praise God <laughs> today we have a haul and I have a new filming set up I hope you guys love it um hopefully i can bring more consistent content for you guys so make sure to subscribe and like and turn your bell notifications so you're notified with all my new content so today's haul oof, baby we're gonna have a time okay and i finally found some staple pieces that i feel like you guys are gonna love so i have a mix of luxury and high street we've got a little bit of prada we got a little bit of um BLA, we've got a little bit of PLT, we've got a bit of skims. I'm giving you, I'm catering for all the girlies. So I hope you guys enjoy this and make sure to like just because I'm back, okay? Without further ado, let's get into the video. Let's get into it. So this haul is going to be a mix of luxury and high street. So what we're going to start off with is my absolute favorite staple that I feel like you guys need. Like, if you want to invest, in a good quality coat which is what i've been looking for for ages i got you like don't ever say that i don't put your guys on because this coat guys this is the coat like she is the moment and i need you guys to take her in because i don't know if she looks in, like, as insane as she deserves on a hanger um this coat is from because of alice it's like a maxi 90s power coat and i got mine in size medium and when I say this coat, it just makes me feel like that girl. Like, it cinches you in on the waist. It's the, it's the length, like the length, the quality is so, he it's so heavy. It feels like really, really luxurious. And it literally just, it literally looks like a designer coat. It reminds me of the Balenciaga coat. I'm obsessed with her. She also comes in black. I feel like I'm gonna get her in black as well because I just can't stop wearing her. So much so that I've got a little <laughs> makeup stain on her but we move because that's what dry cleaners are for like i've been literally wearing this coat to the ground i love her so much i'm gonna link obviously everything in the description box and i'll show you guys how to style her too like how i've been wearing her um you guys probably have seen her a lot on my instagram if you're not following me there that is where you'll get the best you'll get the most consistent posts from me on there but yeah i'm just obsessed with her okay i don't think it's fair to keep you guys waiting any longer i feel like it's only right that i show you my gorgeous new purchases from prada i bought myself two pieces from prada and it's actually my first purchases from prada i've been thinking about these for the longest time like let me show you and i'll show you what i mean so the first item are these prada sunnies I love them. I love her. The shape is just really simple, like a staple. They're just a classic that I feel like I'm never gonna go out of style. Really simple frame and put them on for you guys. I'm just explain it, like a lot of rectangle glasses I feel like don't suit me, but these are like the perfect size um, of width that just looks so good. Whenever you put these on with any outfit, it just automatically elevates it. And I feel like I love investing when i'm buying designer pieces or buying more like expensive pieces i want and i want pieces that i can wear over and over and over again and that is usually what my thought process is and i feel like with glasses like i wear glasses with every outfit if you have a look on my instagram nine times out of ten i'm wearing glasses with an outfit so yeah i thought treat myself and i've been i have been wearing these non-stop so definitely worth the investment and my next prize possession from prada are these gorgeous shoes these gorgeous loafers <laughs> like hello i haven't even worn these out yet because i'm just like in awe of them and i don't want to wreck them but i just need to plan like a really cute outfit for her hard launch because i've done a soft launch on tiktok um unboxing these and i was asking you guys if you think i should keep them and the majority of you did say that i should keep them they're kind of out there for me but i feel like this is the style i'm going more going into like a more like I don't know like a corporate kind of style i really really love these these are also definitely part of my imaginary wardrobe if i worked a boss babe job in the city like a nine to five this is what i'd wear um i love them and i feel like they're gonna go with a lot of things trousers dresses skirts 
um, and I've been wanting them since like last season. I was seeing them everywhere, but I was like, just couldn't bring myself to like press purchase. But this year, I treated myself, and I'm so happy with the decision. What do you guys think? I feel like they're marmite. I don't know if they're marmite, but let me know what you guys think of these specifically. Um, if you would wear them, um, and yeah, I might do like a styling video on this on TikTok or something. So follow me on there as well. But yeah, I just love them so much. I just love them. Next, I want to show you guys another staple that I've been loving, and that is. This shirt, this shirt, she's just the mo like, she's just such a vibe. This shirt is like, just so easy to throw on. I love how oversized it is. It's from Fourth and Reckless, which is a brand that I've absolutely been loving recently. Their new collection is just everything, their 90s collection. I've been loving everything 90s recently and this just reminds me of like when I used to want to be a corporate babe. This is the wardrobe that I'd be giving the girlies at my alleged nine to five. I always wanted to work in like an office and have like a sharp bob, wear like power suits and like power shirts. And I feel like this is what you know. This is the looks that this shirt will be giving um, if I worked nine to five. But anyway, yeah, I love the contrast, wrist detail. I just love everything about it. This quality as well is really, really good. Um, and what I usually wear this with are these trousers from, let me zip her up, give her some modesty. Girl, your flies are open. Like, that is not cute. Okay, <laughs> these trousers. I don't know if they look like much right now, and I need to definitely give them a steam, but I love them. Like, I love them so much. Um, the shape, these are from Because of Alice, and everything from Because of Alice, I feel like, they have just thought so much about the shape and the quality like it's just thick like this material is so good um and even like how they drop on you i have to put them on so you guys can really get an idea but so good these are my actual favorite trousers i need to get them in every single color i think they come in black as well i wish they did work because i've been on the hunt for like a perfect light colored trouser um i haven't fulfilled my mission yet but i'm getting there and when i do i'll show you guys but these trousers exquisite um yeah and i love how they have that sharp iron line i don't know what you'd call it um pleats in the middle like it just gives that boss babe energy and i love her so much okay so next i think we need to bring in some shoes because what is an autumn winter what is autumn winter without like a staple boot that you're just gonna wear to the ground these are her i i love these boots so much i literally had them last season and i wore them so much that i wrecked them so i had to rebuy them and guys when i say these boots are so affordable they're under 50 pounds i believe and look at the material look at the material like ugh. the square toe is it for me like the heel is so comfortable as well. I don't know if this looks high or not, but when I say that these boots are the most comfortable heel boots I have ever owned, they're so comfy. They're zipped inside and yeah, they're really true to size. So you don't even have to size up. They fit really well. You put them on and off really easily. I don't struggle at all. That is why I can't put them down because I'm literally obsessed with them. Um, from PLT. And yeah, they're such good quality. Like I've literally worn these so much and they're still working with your girl. So yeah, I really, really, really love these boots. And I feel like if you're gonna invest in anything in this entire haul, in terms of affordability and everything, like these are that girl, like so good. And you can style them with like jeans, you can style them with trousers, dresses, they go with absolutely everything. So that is why I feel like you have to get these. The other pair of trousers um, you might have seen in my previous vlogs, like I have not put these trousers down. I love them so much. These are actually from Marks and Spencer's and my mom got me these, but I would say they're quite similar to the Because of Alice ones. So I don't know if I'll find a link for these, but I'll link the Because of Alice ones in black as well because they're so versatile and that is what I really want to build my wardrobe to be especially for autumn winter like i just want versatility i want to be able to like mix and match items so i just love to have 
staples that I can throw on and know that they'll look good. So a black trouser, like you actually need a black red trouser in your wardrobe this autumn winter. I say what I say. Right, okay, moving on to, you know, while we're here, let's do a scent. Recently I got scent, this scent. Oh my gosh, I recently got scent, this scent. Cute. From Frenzy. Fenty fragrance, this is the new fragrance, um, and I love her. She smells so good. I feel like, I don't know if I've smelled anything like this before. I've been trying to get more into my scents and my my scent collection is definitely growing. Um, this is like a, she's like a soft oud. She's an oud, but she's like a bit more floral, like not so masculine and sharp, which is what, I usually gravitate towards, but I feel like for daytime, for me anyway, this is like a evening scent. It's so like, it's just so like warm. I'll leave the scent description here, but you guys try her, definitely try her when you see her in store. I feel like this is what Rihanna must smell like. And just because of that, it's worth the purchase. <laughs> so good so so good you guys this is my second most worn jacket for autumn winter and um, this fourth and reckless jacket is just chef's kiss i love her i love her i love her i love her the pocket detailing the little detailing on the side here like the shape the drop the length is everything that i want in a jacket and it's quite loose but it's thick material so it's warm like it's warm enough functional pocket here these pockets aren't functional which i wish they kind of were but i get that you know it will kind of change the shape of the jacket if you know what i mean if you have like a bulging iphone in your pocket so that's fine but i love it i just love it the, even the color is picking up a little bit more great what was it what did i say it's picking up a little bit more blue in the camera but it's like a deep dark charcoal gray and it goes with absolutely everything. Like even this outfit right now, if I pop this on with my like Prada shoes, like that will be an instant look. <laughs> you know what I mean? And that is what I love about all of these pieces that I've been getting recently. That just the versatility and and have like being able to wear them with loads of different outfits. It's a ten out of ten for me. Okay, we're gonna move on to some more staples now. This shirt from Bo It because of Alice as well. I've literally had a massive order from there because I just loved everything that they were releasing. This is a shirt, but this quality, it's just unmatched. Like, it's a crop shirt, and I feel like you can't go wrong with a shirt, like an oversized shirt. And has a pocket over here, like, really self-explanatory, but it's just the shape for me. Like, when I received this, I was like, perfect. I wish they did, like, a bigger shirt. I'm not sure if they do, but I love this investment, and I feel like, obviously, you can re-wear this so much their prices are really pretty good for the quality that they give i'd wear this with trousers maybe like a big blazer maybe like um a knit skirt yeah i feel like this is super versatile and love next we have this skims t-shirt i actually have this in two other colors as well i have i have this brown color and i have the khaki um no i'm literally obsessed with skims I fell into the hype and I believe the hype because, especially because I've got a bigger chest area, they just fit me so well and they make me feel so confident. I can't even explain it. Like I ha I invest in a lot of t-shirts and crop t-shirts and all sorts of tops, but I but I feel like this is the best quality tee I've I've worn, um, it's, and it just kind of it flatters me so well. Um, they've just you can tell they've thought about everything they've thought of the shape they've thought of the material I've worn this so many times and so far so good it hasn't bubbled up on me yet um, yeah it literally hasn't bubbled up and that happens a lot with t-shirts when you re, re when you rewear them they just always bubble up I haven't washed them yet though so I'll have to update you guys on that but like the elasticity of it like it, the way it just hugs you hugs your figure it's just, just so a 10 from me. I was thinking of investing in the maxi dress that they have as well, just because of how nicely I felt in this. I thought, I need a dress, but sold out everywhere. So I did find a dupe, so I'll link this as well. 
this dress is amazing it goes all the way down to my ankles and i'll link it below speaking of dresses this is my absolute favorite mini and um, this is from AYM um the shape of this the quality material and it's sustainable as well um this is from like a independent brand but i just i've been wearing their pieces for years now and this quality is unmatched like it's so good um and even the shape like with this dress i don't even have to wear a bra with it like that is unheard of for me so um it's like double lined i think so that's why it kind of holds you up you need this i wish they did a maxi version i'll have a look on the website but i just love it so much and the way it shapes you in all the right places is fantastic and yeah shout out to all the brands making women feel just so much more confident and so much more you know wholesome in their pieces because we need that so onto this gorgeous power suit also from because of alice this is turning into because of alice hall but i've just been loving their simplicity and which is kind of what they stand for their simplicity their like shapes their quality is just so amazing so i have this power suit which is like a two-piece suit blazer and trousers set and it also it comes with a belt which i love and it kind of cinch in your waist um i love the shoulders it's a little bit padded just to give you that elevated like boss babe vibe this is um another staple that i've been wearing the trousers also are so good I wish they were a little bit more flexible, but I get that it's a power suit, so you kind of want that structure. But yeah, super, super great quality. Like, it's just unmatched. It's so unmatched. Um, I buy blazers. I have a lot of blazers, and I'd say that um, this is some of the best quality. Other than, like, vintage blazers or, like, super high ticket blazers, this is, like, a really nice middle ground price tag with really good quality. You guys might know that I really rarely wear jeans, but when I do, these jeans are the, my go-to. These are Levi's jeans. The shape, I'm all about um, being comfortable. I hate this, even the sound of fitted tight jeans right now. Not my bag. So I love these, how they're loose, um, but they really still fit really well. They're still chic. I love the drop of them. I love that you can wear them with like a big knitted jumper or like a blazer. Um, you can wear them with boots, with trainers, and they like just work so i love yeah so i definitely have to include these in there because even though i don't always wear jeans like when i do i definitely look for these and if i can't find them i'm wearing trousers and that's just there on there surprise surprise we have another blazer um this blazer is my absolute favorite white blazer that i own um this is from Blythe. This is a small woman owned business, which the owner, Abby Blythe, I've met her once. She's an influencer and I love her collection. So had to support, but also I was so pleasantly surprised when this arrived. Like it's so good. Like I love it. I love the shape. I love how big it is. I love how you can wear it with everything and anything. I love the tone of white as well. It's not like a stark white, it's like a nice off white. Highly recommend if you're trying to build your blazer collection. This is really nice. I can also see this like for party season with something shiny underneath, maybe even like a simple satin dress inside. Did I get it in a medium? Yeah, I got it in a medium, but because it's already oversized, you can literally wear it as a blazer dress. And I would maybe wear this with like my Prada um, shoes with some cute little black socks or white socks. Yeah, super versatile, which is the aim of the game. And I love her. Last but not least with the clothing items, I have yet another crap blazer. Don't hate me. I just love blazers. I feel like the easiest way to go from like a bummy outfit to like a chic outfit is throwing a blazer on. And that's why I have so many because they just work. And um, this is a crop blazer. This is from Fourth and Reckless as well. The trousers, it's like a two piece. I also love two piece for this two pieces. Ugh, English girl for the simplicity of it like not having to think about an outfit is just my bag but i've already shown you my most worn boots but these are definitely my most worn trainers i don't want to touch the bottom because they're literally probably filthy <laughs> all these balenciaga track twos i was contemplating buying these for a while but i finally got them when i went to vista village which is like an outlet store they had my size and they were discounted heavily like by 30 percent maybe i think so i had to get them they're so heavy, 
But guys, when you want some runaround trainers, these are your girls. Like, you can really wash them off really easily. You can just work them down. It's not like a um, fabric, so like you're not so worried about wearing them all the time. I wear these all the time, even though they're designer trainers, which is what I love about them. Like the quality of the material just makes it for like, you can actually wear them. And what is the point of getting items or designer items and we, you're too scared to wear them? So yeah. That helps a lot. And uh, these go with everything as well. Trousers, jeans, even dresses. I've styled these a lot on my Instagram. Um, yeah, I love them. They, they are heavy, they weigh like a ton. But you don't feel them when they're on. <laughs> um, yeah, I've got these in a size four or 37. And I love them. And I love the color as well. Like they go with everything, especially for autumn winter. So yeah. Next we have these. Beezies. <laughs> I got these from Ego. Um, when I got them, I didn't think I'd wear them, but guys, I wear them all the time. They're so comfy. They're so lightweight. Um, if you wear them with socks underneath, I know they've got holes in, <laughs> but when you wear them with socks underneath, unless it's obviously raining, like you can really literally wear them um, even when it's super cold outside. Um, super lightweight, like I said, they go with everything. Um, they literally go with everything. Like it depends on your style, obviously. I feel like these are definitely Marmite as well, but I feel like they just instantly tan an outfit like way cooler. Um, so yeah, I love these and they were pretty affordable. I also have the white color in these as well and the gray because I just wear them that much. Um, you can even wear them indoors, like so comfy. Highly recommend, ooh, airport outfits, like running to the store, running errands, they go with everything. And last but not least, I have these boots. I've been looking for some boots, pointed boots for a minute and I finally found some that are really good length and they're not really super high. Like, I don't know if they look high on camera, but they are not so high um, where they're gonna be super, super uncomfortable to walk in. I would wear this with maybe a dress, like a mini, like for example, that AYM dress that I showed you, the black one um, from earlier. I'd wear that with these or like a maxi skirt or mini skirt. They just make your outfits that are a little bit more like risque, like a mini in the winter, in the autumn winter, um, a lot more wearable and a lot more like warm. Like you can actually cover your legs with these. But yeah, so I love these. I love the shape of the heel. I love the pointiness. I wish they were a little bit more pointy, I'm not gonna lie, like I'm more exaggerated. But you can't have it all. And these are from Ego, so they're pretty affordable. Um, so yes. Um, is that all we have in the haul? Because this next piece is really, really basic to be honest. But I haven't had a scarf in like maybe two, three years. I don't know why. And I feel like scarves are really in this season. Obviously for warmth, but also just like for styling, I, um, for styling outfits. These wide scarves have been, I'm using them everywhere. Um, all the designer brands are coming out of like bold prints. So I started off with a starter pack. Um, I got this really nice wide scarf. Um, this is just from Primarini. I feel like they add a really classy, like put together um, element to an outfit. You look like you're going somewhere and you've got places to be. Like when you swing your scarf and just like, power walking to your destination you look like you know what you're doing only thing i'd say is probably put this in the wash before you wear it because it did give me some lint on my clothes but definitely will be investing in more scarves this season i must include as well this bag i had so many questions on it when i wore it on my instagram this silver shiny bag it's really affordable i feel like it was under 20 pounds um, I really wanted the Zara one, but it was sold out. So this is the next best thing. So I'll link it below as well. And um, what I wore this with was some cargos and that Skims top and some uh, and some heels. And it looked fire, the outfit was fire. So link it below for you guys. So guys, we've come to the end of the haul. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. I enjoyed filming it and I'm so glad to be back. I hope you guys will subscribe and turn your bell notifications on for my future videos thank you so much for watching if you stay till the end type in this emoji and then i'll know that you guys stayed to the end love you guys so much and i'll see you guys in my next video